We went in search of the weirdest, largest, whatever's places in America that delight and make you say, huh? This is Roadside Attractions Highway 1. 17 miles south of Monterey and just 5 miles off Highway 1 sits the town of Castroville, California. In 1923, the first artichoke was planted here. Today, Castroville is known as the artichoke capital of the world. So why would you take the detour to visit Castroville? To see the world's largest artichoke, that's why. This is the largest artichoke in the world. This is the daughter of the guy who owns this 20-foot vegetable monument. So the artichoke is made out of concrete and the little spines that you can see sticking out are reinforced iron or steel poles. It's attached to the Giant Artichoke Restaurant, and it's what we're most proud of here in Castroville. <laughs> the artichoke actually first started out on the roof. At some point, it was moved down and turned into this ginormous thing behind me. It's basically just here to remind people that are passing through that this is, in fact, the artichoke capital of the world. So where are the real artichokes? The field that you see here behind me is approximately 100 acres. Tens of thousands of artichokes will come out of this field and be delivered fresh to our customers. That sure is a lot of artichokes. <laughs> and at the Giant Artichoke Restaurant, they put them to good use. We got fried artichoke hearts, steamed artichoke hearts, fire roasted artichoke, spinach and artichoke dip, artichoke burger, artichoke and angel hair pasta, steamed... I already said that. Can I start again? Yes, yeah, go again. Fried our choke hearts. So with all this hearts. choking goodness, what's the best thing on the menu? Actually, the best Philly steak sandwich I've ever had was here. And I guess they also have Philly cheesesteak sandwiches. Having the world's largest artichoke in town is a conversation piece. It's something that everyone has their picture taken with. And while you've got your camera handy, keep a lookout for Castroville's own mascot. Yep, his name is Artie. We might be a small town, but we're great in our own ways, and this is just one way to show it. So the next time you're driving Highway 1 and are in the mood for giant vegetables... We really like our giant vegetables and fruits here. You know where to go.